What's up, guys? Welcome back to the RN TV YouTube channel. Today, we're gonna be driving out to my house. We'll be staying there this week, getting some shit done. And also, mentioned it last video, I wanna grab my subs out of the F-150, slap those in my new truck. I miss having bass, man, bad. Also, this video, I wanted to include some gym content, something I've haven't done since like 2019. And even then, only had like a little 30 second snippet of me working out. So, and I don't have a crazy physique or anything like that. Ain't got no pump right now, bad lighting. Put on a little bit of muscle mass over the year. Been staying pretty consistent. This video is brought to you by Manscaped. And we just got a package from them. Let's check it out. The Performance Package 4.0. Your balls will thank you. Oh yeah. The Lawn Mower 4.0. Got a ceramic blade on it to keep your boys safe. It even has a spotlight on it for a more precise shave. It's actually waterproof. It's got a battery level indicator on it. And we got the, the Weed Whacker 2.0 for your nose and ears. Cordless, rechargeable. Got some liquid remedies in here too. Ball deodorant and some ball toner. Those will keep your package smelling right throughout the day that's nice fancy looking little travel bag bunch of different accessories for the lawnmower and the weed whacker we got a pair of anti-chafing boxers some are soft yeah if you want to join me and eight million other men on self-improvement and endeavors that really matter go to manscape.com you get 20 percent off when you use my code rntv at checkout free shipping 20 percent off all the details and the link will be in the description below all right y'all we're down here at the old house these little packages Packets, pink salmon, small little meal. Sister invited me over for some spaghetti. I can go partake in some of that. Snack mix, you know, gotta get some carbs in there. Lord Ramsey would be proud. Yeah, we're gonna go to the gym tonight. I guess we're going full influencer mode. I'm gonna bring the camera in there. Hate doing that shit. I don't like to be that guy, you know, but kind of what I do. About to go out to the gym. Man, I was supposed to have um, supplements come in the mail today. I don't use pre-workout or nothing. I don't really like pre-workout. I mean, shit definitely works, but if you don't take it every day, you feel like dog shit when you don't take it. I got this shit this dude gave me a GNC. We're gonna try it out. Pixie pump, basically just like a pixie stick. No pre in it. Try it out. That's free. Is that sour gummy? That's sour. Understandable. <laughs> I inhaled some of it. All right, y'all. Go up to 225 a day. Try to get it for at least five times. Not sure if I'll get it though, because it went pretty hard on the last chest day. Yep, stretch some rotator cuffs. Yeah. A few pull ups too. Just get the back stiff. Have a good base to bench off of. says anything yeah I do lift my butt off the bench a little bit bad habit but I don't want to fix the habit until I'm able to like cut that shit out you know what I'm saying <laughs> This is how it is. Before I hit that PR a few days ago of seven, came in the week before that, could only hit 225 for three. Every week you come in, variates. So weird.
Bass drop turned off. What the fuck? You gotta wait for a bass drop. One more set of five. Then a burnout of 185 right after. Some incline dumbbell. Starting out with sixties. Turn the exposure down and do what the other YouTubers do. Alex, you bank coming for you, dog. Give me another year or two. Or, matter of fact, just go ahead and hop on TRT. Let me get the clout for the natty physique. Yeah, I'm really not that big. I need to calm down. All right, back at the house. Usually only drink one protein shake per day. But today, I didn't really eat a lot. Only eight bowl of skitty, pack of tuna. Right now, two packs of chicken salad. Brush up some burritos. Put that on there. Fuck it. Chicken salad. Gas. Crunch it up. Yep. Tomorrow we're gonna slap the sub in the super duty. Finally have some base, man. Fuck. Just ate a disgusting amount of oysters. Stayed up to like two in the morning last night could not sleep i don't know if it was that pixie pump shit or what or if the fact i'm sleeping in a dog shit ass recliner don't have a mattress in my room we got a new supplement came in today anybody watching this don't fucking try these supplements let me try them for a little bit i'll be y'all's guinea pig this guy on the internet named dr andrew huberman says that these two natural ingredients can increase testosterone now, i know that sounds like a fucking porn hub ad but i mean he's an actual real deal doctor fuck i sound brainwashed 
right now. No, there's literally no game. Doesn't have any affiliation with these companies and they're cheap. Why the fuck not try it out? Supposedly increases natural testosterone by one to 200 points. Can increase your free test. Tongue cut alley. Basically works as an aromatase inhibitor. Blocks the conversion of testosterone to estrogen. And then this one sounds like a fucking Harry Potter spell. Fedogia agrestis. Fedogia agrestis! <laughs> basically mimics luteinizing hormone, which is something that's secreted by your hypothalamus and your brain. Signal your testes to produce testosterone. You have to cycle it though. Apparently it's bad for your Lydeg cells. Fuck, who knows? I could take these pills, turn into a fucking woman next month. Nuts fall off. That's what I'm saying, don't try these. But yeah, let me stop trying to prove I'm intellectually worth a fuck. Pop this shit. It'll take like a week to notice the difference. Bro, I feel so fucking flaccid today. There's gonna be a comment. Oh, I wanted you to do the pack one with me, y'all, man. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, bro. I've been doing it for so long, and I've done it so many times, that it's gotten to the point where it's fucking cringy for me. So I don't want to do it, so I'm just not. All right, let's go outside. Let's throw some shoes on. I want to be shirtless, though. Like, well, females can't do it, then neither should males be allowed to. Hey, girl, go ahead, be shirtless. I ain't gonna tell you otherwise. But yeah, I know for a fact you can have your shirt off on YouTube. For one, weightlifting content, obviously. And then two, they got those motherfucking primitive videos for those people that are out there building a mansion with a stick and dirt. Those motherfuckers are full on barefoot, bro. You're gonna tell me I can't have my shirt off and they're all out there, 10 dogs exposed for free. Like, come on now. There's people that'll pop a stiffy over that shit. So I'm thinking, hopefully the sub, I won't have to put it on the seat. Maybe it'll fit behind the middle console. Put y'all on the other side so y'all aren't just staring at my ass the whole time. You know, first thing first, you should probably take the sub out of the Ford. See if it'll fit. Why is there wasps everywhere, man? Come on. Fucker, I ain't gonna fuck with you if you don't fuck with me. You gotta be fucking out of your mind right now. Maybe I can put these seats up, slide them around in there, and then slide the seats back down. Yep. I mean, that's decent. Not all the way back, but we'll have subs. Got the sub behind my seat, so I'll hear the bass the most. Oh yeah, somebody said, oh, the door dinger's going off because you got your lights on auto. Watch this. Dealership I bought from still hasn't even sent me the damn license plate for it. Matter of fact, I'm gonna call them about that. Y'all sent that license plate out uh, last Friday for a 05 F250. I haven't received it yet. Do you have any tracking details for that? It, it should have been, been there right now. Let me double check so we can move on and see uh, what happens. All right, you me call back in 30 minutes or you call me back? Yeah, that's fine. Uh, are you gonna call me back or do you want me to call back? Yeah, I'll go. All right, appreciate right. you. Later. Guarantee they don't call back. Don't know why, just don't feel like they were fucking silly shit, man. Can't be driving around with expired tags. Supposed to have already sent me a damn license plate in the mail. Got a Roxford Fosgate 500 watt amp. And um, the sub is a P3 power punch subwoofer. We're already low on battery. I'm gonna put y'all in charge. I gotta pop all these little panels off, take the wire out. I'll be back. Yank the RCA cables out. They stuck into the back of the radio. So I gotta go get some new ones. Sadly, living in the middle of fucking nowhere. I'm all the way 45 minutes an hour the nearest walmart which is the only place that has them hopefully it's still light when i get back i don't know if it will be or not but regardless still gonna slap the shit in got some plug-in lights gonna go get some new rca cables oh! can y'all even see man fucker tiniest fucking buttons and a baby's finger couldn't fit in she's totaled While I'm here, I'm about to look up how to fucking find the door chime. It is so annoying, bro. I know people are like, just take the fuse out for it. Knowing these damn Fords, the fucking door chime fuse is probably connected to the damn fuel pump or something stupid. Six F-250 going there with a little screwdriver. And it, it, the... All right, got the cluster out. Find this fucking speaker. <laughs> I think I found her.
<laughs> and there she is. Well, the only thing that looks like a speaker in here is this guy right here. Yeah. Let's just hope and pray that that was the door chime. Ooh. Moment of truth. See if we fucked anything up. This is terrifying. I haven't done tedious shit like this in a long time. <laughs> no door dinger. <laughs> Mileage is popping up. The needles are off just a tad. I mean, that's no big deal though. At least I know. I mean, that's not bothersome enough where I'm gonna take this shit back apart. I got all the gauges I need right here on my tuner. Now we can actually start with the fucking audio. Got the wires ran to the back seat, ran it up through here and then behind there. So you won't be able to see any wires. Ran them all the way through up here, up under the carpet, and here they are dangling. Splice the remote wire in. We'll have some subs. All right. <laughs> super dark so i'm gonna wait till tomorrow show y'all more about the subs to go inside fix me something to eat fucking starving before i hop off here i want to show y'all what i cooked for din din grubbing on tonight bunch of spinach gigantic salmon patty skip the damn gym today I feel like a piece of shit yesterday when we went to the gym we really didn't even go that hard honestly go tomorrow probably just hit chest again Bro, my chest lacks a lot on the rest of my body. So I've been trying to focus on it a little bit more, especially my upper chest. I am absolutely filthy right now. <sighs> Rancid. I don't know what it is, man. I don't know if it's the radio or the fact that it's two batteries instead of one now. Fucker bumps. For 112, it's absurd. <laughs> she is he's bumping hard a little too hard sounds like it's rattling on the inside of the sub i give it about a week for the sub blows good god man i can smell my musk um next video led tough pods we'll just rock lights installing those next video day it's gonna be pissing I'm gonna do some housework on the inside bathroom final coat of mud on it rise today we'll go ahead and prime it hope y'all enjoyed that video There's gonna be more to come we're gonna be getting internet here soon out here next week so until then i gotta drive with my parents to edit these videos i'm recording i love y'all and i'll see you in the next one later